Well, as you can see, I've got uh, the outdoors showing, and that's the window view from my studio. And it's been snowing. We're not getting very much. It's just enough to make the roofs in the distance white, and that's about it. Yes, yeah, the uh, heater's on. That's what you hear in the background. I'm going to wait for it to turn off before I actually do anything uh, or talk about what I'm going to do. I've changed the... Uh, design of my uh, uh, statue that I'm getting ready to start and I'll talk about that in a second. Time to play with some clay. I've come up with an alternative design. I like this one, uh, but I'm starting to think it's too gimmicky. Uh, and it just... I came up with another idea. And it, uh, I thought about it last night, and I was even getting up in the middle of the night, walking into my kitchen doing the pose. <laughs> and... Uh, that's how ridiculous I get sometimes. But I wanted to see what kind of action it would take. And when you're 74 years old and your balance ain't the best, twisting around all of a sudden you know, can make you fall. And uh, I didn't fall. Anyway, I'm taking the uh, nut off of the uh, support. And I'm going to tell you why in a second here, as soon as I get this done. This is what attaches it to the, uh, the main drop the nut. This nut and a groove in the uh, post is what you slide your armature into and then you tighten it down with this uh, nut. I'm going to see what I can do about doing this without the uh, armature support. And uh, nothing wrong with the uh, support nor anything like that. It's just that uh, I want to try a different uh, way of doing it. Okay, I'm thinking of uh, doing the sculpture with just one armature support and that'll be this uh, armature support. I'm not sure it's going to work. I'm just going to try it out and see what happens. No, that's not going to work. And it's because it interferes with the ankle of the foot, and the foot and the lower part of the leg is going to show uh, through the clothing of uh, the gentleman I'm doing. Alright, I'm going to reattach the uh, armature. trying to do is adjust the height to where I can make a base.
Oh, by the way, I did find uh, the other arm for uh, this uh, on another sculpture, and so another armature, 24 incher, and I was able to use it on this. And uh, I just have to adjust the sculpture to uh, match the uh, pose that I want to do. Again, you grab at the uh, joints. You don't grab at the middle of the arm because you break it. I'm imagining Jesus walking and uh, he sees someone that uh, is standing there watching him walk by. He turns to look at him after he's passed him and he says, come follow me. And that's, I think, is going to be the title. And uh, the uh, addendum, or the uh, Addition to that title would be, uh, I am the way. I'll have to work out the base when it's not snowing and I can go outside and saw the wood. Uh, Now we'll see what happens. Anyway, that's as far as I'm going to get today. I just wanted to get this worked out of my head. That's something I <laughs> laid in bed the whole night last night thinking about. Yeah, I can't do anything until I make a base for it, so I can't do that right now. But I like to pose. Uh, hang on, bring this shoulder out just a little bit further. The beauty of these uh, two form armatures, I mean, I can make my own armature, I mean, that's not a big deal. But the beauty of these things is you can get the angles of the hip and the shoulders and work out the, the flow of the uh, movement, and you can actually get a feeling for what the movement's going to be. And, uh, I don't know if this is going to work or not, but I'm going to, I'm just playing with the idea right now. All right. That's going to be it, I guess, for now. I'll see you guys after Thanksgiving. I'm going to take a couple of days off and I guess I won't know until I start putting the clay on it. And I can't do that until I figure out the base. Good night, everybody. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right. See you next time.